In this video, we will be covering loading, syncing, and saving. To load videos, select the two playback screen option and then drag your videos from the file browser into the two screens. Next, make sure the frame display is set to classic and frame numbers. It's also going to be useful to set up a spreadsheet to keep track of your key frame numbers. Now to synchronize your videos, navigate to a frame that is common between the two videos. Write down the frame number that each video is at, and then select one of your videos and go back to the frame that you would like to start analysis from. Next, record the number of your selected start frame and subtract this number from the first number you recorded. This will be the number of frames that you offset the video by. Then click the square bracket to set your working zone first frame. This will reset the frame of your second video. The next step is to subtract the number of frames you offset the first video by from the number that you recorded from the second video. Now navigate to that frame on the second video and set your working zone start frame. To set the working zone final frame, play through the video to where you'd like to end your analysis and hit the square out bracket. Take note of the length of this video as you will use this to set the working zone of your second video. After setting the working zone for each video, you can now save your videos in AVI format. To do this, select each video separately and then select Save under the File menu.